What's going on guys? Spider here for Destiny and uh, we're gonna show you exactly how to get the husk of the pit. This is a hive weapon. It's an auto rifle primary weapon. Make sure you have a slot space in your primaries. If not, I would imagine it goes to the postmaster, but maybe not. So just in case, make sure you have that space available. All right, we're just doing a patrol on Earth and there are a couple of spots in the moth yards where the Blades of Crota do spawn in. And what you have to do is take out the Blades of Crota in order for this to drop. It's a random drop. Now that they just added into the patch, I think the other day, the first person to get it was somebody playing the demo. He's like level seven and he's playing the demo and it dropped. And ever since the patch, people have been getting it like crazy. So you can do the Fist of Crota mission. And I did try to do that. And that's the mission they patched in today. The first mission of the Dark below DLC, which uh, previously we couldn't replay. You can go in there and uh, farm that uh, spot if you want. I tried it like probably 20 or 30 times and I didn't get anything. So I thought, you know what, let's just try it on Earth or Cosmodrome. We'll do our patrols and we'll see what happens. And here we go. These guys are going to drop it. There it is. Boom. Yes. In fact, that is the husk of the pit, a primary auto rifle. All right. We're going to take a look at it here in a second. Okay, we're doing a little bit of an epic jump here, and um, boom, with the sword, we're gonna just get rid of the super, and uh, we're gonna check this thing out, all right? So here it is, Husk of the Pits, auto rifle desiccated and nigh inoperable. This hive artifact still manages to send shivers up your spine when fired. It's got a 138 attack, a rate of fire is insane. The impact is obviously very, very low, but it's not really about the stats, and uh, we're gonna take a look at the upgrades, obviously it does connect damage, but this cannibalism, the husk exudes a sense of sinister satisfaction when used to expire its former allies. So we're gonna have to kill Hive with this thing, all right? And then in order to upgrade it, we need a bombing orb. While well, the embalming orb is, orb is only available via Eris Morn, all right, the vendor. So uh, that's it, we got uh, the Husk of the Pit. We're just gonna uh, run around here and uh, check out the sight on it. That's pretty freaking awesome, I love that sight. That is cool, all right? And uh, we're just gonna search for some uh, Fallen. I know we don't have any Hive anywhere nearby. So we're gonna just uh, take a look and see if we can't take some out and just see how this weapon does in fact operate. Um, you know, not going to be very useful if you're running a level 30 heroic mission, but, uh, you know, for these mobs, uh, it's pretty much fine. I think it's a level 10. Yeah, so yeah, guys, stay tuned. We're going to have more. We're going to get this thing uh, upgraded. I'm going to go kill some hive, and you know where. I think it's the dark below, right? We've awakened the hive! Shoot them all, shoot all the thrall, and see how long it's going to take us to, uh, get this thing, the upgrade completed, all right? Or at least the node complete so that we can upgrade. All right, so we'll be back with more, guys. Stay tuned. I'm Spotter and I'm out.